lesson um, for sorting multiples, which is one of the eight modules uh, included in Middle School Math HD for the iPad. So let's first look at some multiples. Um, we can see a few examples of what multiples are. So let's just talk here about uh, multiples of three. Uh, what we do to, to find multiples is we, we really just multiply um, three by um, all the counting numbers. So three times one is three, three times two is six, three times three is nine. So essentially we're just counting by threes. Uh, and in the next example, uh, multiples of four, same idea, um, just counting by fours, four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28. Uh, and they carry forward, obviously, they, they go on. Uh, we can see that uh, there are some numbers that are common to both these. So sometimes we, we, uh, we talk about common multiples. And uh, it's not the only number that's common. Uh, 24 is also common in both lists. So what we can say is that um, the common multiples of 3 and 4 are uh, 12, 24. Um, and obviously this would continue as well. There's many more um, common multiples of, of 3 and 4. The next one, for instance, would be, would be 36. Okay, so now we have an understanding of multiples. Let's um, try to connect it with factors. Uh, it's really factors really are the, the the opposite of multiples. So let's do the factors of 24. And what we're really trying to do is find all the ways in which we can uh, arrive at 24 through multiplication um, using whole numbers. Uh, so the first example would be 1 times 24. Um, we can always get uh, a number by multiplying it by 1. Uh, another example or another way to get to 24 would be uh, 2 times 12, um, 3 times 8 and uh, 4 times 6. So it's really important just to know your math facts uh, to, to, uh, to do these factors. Um, we can notice here that um, if we go back a slide and look at those multiples that 24 was a common multiple of 3 and 4. So we should have it show up when we do factors if it is you know the opposite, um, basically the opposite of doing multiples. So it's no surprise that they're there. Um, so factors of 24 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12, and 24. So we usually like to write it in a list. Um, just like that. Um, so we'll also go over what a, a prime number is, what a composite number is. So a prime number is exactly two factors. Uh, for instance, the numbers 3, 5, and 23. The only factors um, that 3 has are 1 uh, times 3, so the number times itself. So it's really uh, the, the what, what makes a number prime is that it can only be multiplied uh, by 1 uh, to, to get that product. A uh, composite number has uh, more than two factors. Uh, examples of this would be 4, uh, 9, 24. So, um, for instance, 9 only has three factors, uh, one in itself, um, and uh, of course, three times three. So, we could say that 9 has uh, the factors 1, 3, and 9. Okay, let's, let's look at the, the game sorting multiples and, and make the connection between uh, factors and multiples. So, so the, what we try to do here is uh, drag the crab to the right location on the base of the screen. We need to decide whether it, um, it belongs in the multiples of two, uh, common multiples of two and three, or multiples of three. So the first crab uh, has a three, uh, or is a three, so what we want to do uh, is drag that to the multiples of three. We, we learned about multiples would be three, six, nine, twelve. So it fits there. It doesn't fit into two because when we, when we count by twos, we say two, four, six, eight. Uh, so it does not fit. So it, it only goes in that spot. It couldn't possibly be a common multiple if it doesn't match up with two. The next one, 9, also goes in that spot. Um, again, um, 9 is a multiple of 3. We count by 3, 3, 6, 9. Uh, and we can look at it from the other way, that you know, 9 has 3 as a factor, so therefore um, it goes in that, in that slot. Uh, 9 doesn't have 2 as a factor, so uh, again, it wouldn't go there. Uh, 6 is, is an example where it actually would go uh, in the middle, because it is a common multiple. Because when we look at the factors of 6, we see that you know, 2 times 3 is 6, so indeed, uh, it would be placed in that uh, in that slot. In, in any event, um, there's lots of different uh, multiples and uh, or common multiples that you can be working with in sorting multiples. Uh, and this is great practice for you to get uh, really quick uh, with this stuff. And I uh, hope you really enjoy Middle School Math HD and all the great activities. Thanks.